we're seeing the sober you right now. And I like the sober you. Yeah. 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 I gotta sit next to my mom. Okay, okay. Give us a moment, bro. It's my mother. I know. I it's need all right. Sit, I need, but I need there, to sit there. Well, here. then I'll step off stage and do you want you? Yeah, I think it's a great idea. All right. Okay. See you later. We'll come we'll get come you in a minute. We'll come grab you in a sec. Jane, it's really important for us to impart on you the fact that you are not responsible for everyone. You don't have to be super mom every single day. You can be here and do this That's all for I know. you. That's all I know. And we're trying to show you a different reality because there is a you that Ugh. isn't all wrapped up in what you do for others. That's not your identity for in your been entire my life. Identity. But what, but what, my do they, what do they say, Jane? And everyone's heard this when they're on an airplane. You put on your own oxygen mask first. Yes. Because if you- I heard you that the other that day. Analogy. I heard right. that the other day. Great analogy. Because you cannot help anyone else if you yourself are not okay. So, Aaron left the stage. You wanna know why? Because deep down he loves you. He's trying to protect you, but here's the deal. He can't do that. You have to protect yourself. You can't yeah. change the yeah. past. Yes. But you can change your future starting right here, right yeah. now. And, and the first thing you have to do is just right here with me right now. Tell me who the most important person in your life is at this moment, right here, right now. You know what I'm getting at, I right? know what your answer, my answer is well, supposed to be. Okay. Well, be a good supposed student. Supposed to be me. <laughs> yes, that's not being yes, selfish. It's not. Too many people in this world are selfish. I look at you and I think, yeah. wow. <laughs> I wish Jane would get a little more selfish. That's right. Jane, self-care is selfless. Do you believe that? I want to, I want to learn it. Okay. Yeah. Because the truth it. is right now, your best friend is alcohol. Mm. Yeah. And it's a bad best friend. Yeah. If you're willing to, can you take us back to some moments when you've been drinking and the person you become? Maybe things you've done that you regret? Oh yeah, definitely. I've, I've sent texts that were mean and nasty that I never would normally do. Mm -hmm. I've fought with, with people that I love. Would it be fair to say that alcohol has led you to have terrible relationships in general? Yeah, yeah, it's because I bottle everything up inside and then when I, when I have a few drinks, then I feel like, oh, I can be tough and strong and, and say what I really feel, yeah. you know. And, and, and then and of it's course not the really what I really feel, it's all the well, alcohol. Everything talk. comes out and then, of course, the cycle is, and when you get sober, you feel horrible about yeah. yourself. Yeah. Oh, yeah. You try to over-apologize, and, and yet these things have been done, and then you feel bad and you reach for alcohol again, because mm -hmm. that makes it go away, yeah. right? Exactly. Yeah. That's a terrible cycle to be in. It's my reality. And I also want to tell you, there's nothing to be ashamed of with the way you're living your life. Nope. And you know, you're, you're working, you're trying to it's make awesome. ends meet and you're doing that while battling an addiction. Mm -hmm. And so what that tells me is that you do have a lot of strength yep. and it's going to take strength to, to get over this, right? Yeah. It's yeah. not easy. Yeah. I'm scared. I am. One of the other reasons I'm happy you're here is because as you continue to drink more and more, when you become physiologically dependent on alcohol and you stop using, it can create medical emergencies. Yeah, right. And so it's not, when you tell me you're not feeling good, there is a, there is a medical reason. You would agree with us that what you need right now is professional help. Yeah, definitely. I want it. That's why I'm here. What are you willing to do for it? Anything you tell me. Okay. Yeah. You're the doctors. <laughs>